Hello everyone. Welcome to Tells Vichenry. Today November 11th, our word of the day is fastidious. F-A-S-T-I-D-I-O-U-S Fastidious Fastidious is a ten-letter word and an adjective. Remember, adjectives are words that describe the qualities or states of being of nouns, enormous, dog-like, silly, yellow, fun, fast. They can also describe the quantity of nouns, many, few, millions, eleven. Fastidious means giving too much attention to small details and wanting everything to be correct and perfect. In other words, very attentive to and concerned about accuracy and detail. If you want to describe a person who insists on perfection or pays much attention to food, clothing, and cleanliness, the right word is fastidious. Fastidious is a funny-sounding adjective from the Latin fastidium, loathing, that has several equally strange-sounding synonyms, persnickety, fussbudgety, finicky, and punctilious. Fussy and hard to please will also do the trick. Fastidious is occasionally used as a compliment to describe someone whose attention to detail gives them good organizing abilities, but it is usually used as a disapproving term. Fastidious is an adjective that describes someone who is very attentive to detail and has high standards for cleanliness, organization, and quality. If you want to use this word in a sentence, there are a few tips you should keep in mind to ensure that you use it correctly and effectively. Understand the meaning of fastidious. Before you can use the word fastidious in a sentence, you need to understand what it means. Fastidious is a word that describes someone who is very particular about the details and has high standards for cleanliness, organization, and quality. This person may be very meticulous in their work or very particular about the way things are done. Use fastidious to describe a person. One of the most common ways to use the word fastidious is to describe a person. For example, you might say, my boss is very fastidious about the way the office is organized. This sentence means that your boss is very particular about how things are arranged in the office and has high standards for cleanliness and organization. Use fastidious to describe a task or project. Another way to use the word fastidious is to describe a task or project. For example, you might say, the project required a fastidious attention to detail. This sentence means that the project required a lot of attention to detail and a high level of precision. Use fastidious in a positive or negative context. Fastidious can be used in both a positive and negative context. For example, you might say, I appreciate my friend's fastidious attention to detail when it comes to planning events. This sentence means that you appreciate your friend's attention to detail and high standards for quality. On the other hand, you might say, my boss's fastidiousness can be frustrating at times. This sentence means that your boss's high standards for cleanliness and organization can be frustrating. Use fastidious sparingly. Finally, it's important to use the word fastidious sparingly. While it's a useful word, using it too often can make your conversation sound repetitive or overly formal. Instead, try to use a variety of words to describe someone's attention to detail or high standards for quality. In conclusion, Fastidious is a useful word that can be used to describe someone's attention to detail or high standards for cleanliness, organization, and quality. To use this word effectively, it's important to understand its meaning, use it to describe a person or task, use it in a positive or negative context, and use it sparingly. By following these tips, you can use the word fastidious to enhance your writing and communication skills. Similar words include scrupulous, punctilious, painstaking, meticulous, assiduous, sedulous, perfectionist, fussy, finicky, dainty, overparticular, critical, overcritical. Examples of sentences using fastidious are He is very fastidious about how a suitcase should be packed. They were too fastidious to eat in a fast food restaurant. My mother was a fastidious woman who always had a complaint on her lips. 
Your friends will be few if you do not change your habit of being fastidious. My mother-in-law is the most fastidious person on this planet. Despite Marilyn's high grades, the professor remained fastidious in his assessment of her academic skills. Make sure to save this new word, fastidious, so you can practice using it in your everyday sentences. That's all for today. Thank you for spending your time with me. I hope you learned something new. Remember, practice makes perfect, and we'd love to hear from you, so leave a comment after every video. All comments are welcome. Don't forget to like and share this video. Subscribe to this channel and hit the notification bell so you receive similar videos every day. Have a fulfilling day. See you tomorrow. Cheers!